Welcome to Joe B, a movie and a bottle of wine. Hey everybody, it's Joe B and Matt and the cat. She's here. And a movie Yay. and a bottle of wine. Hi baby. So glad you guys came back. We've been gone for a couple of weeks. We've been busy. We've been drunk and passed out. That's what we did. Oh. We waited until too late and we were drunk and passed the hell out. Oh, but I got nice lots of movies. Yeah, there you go. Lots okay. of movies for cool. you guys. Cool. Um, I gotta tell you a song that okay. has been stuck in my head. From An earworm, little, as they call it. Earworm? From Little Monsters. Okay. It's Doo from Hanson. Oh, gosh, yes. Doo that's right. All yep. right, you guys, I'm putting that okay. earworm in your ear. There he goes. We've watched a lot of great movies. We have. Yep. We haven't been here to tell you about it, but I wrote them down. There she goes. I wrote them she down. remembers. They're all right here. Pepperidge Farm remembers. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to start with Dead Earth. This was pretty good. If you like zombie movies, it was Ooh. these two girls, and they were in the zombie apocalypse, and they were going through it together. It was a really good movie. They fought and fought and fought, and in the end, I, I hate to spoil her. Uh -oh. I hate to spoil her, uh -oh. but they just have to keep going on. They got to keep moving. Okay. I swear, in a zombie apocalypse, I think I would let them eat me because I would be like, you know what? I cannot run all night and day. <laughs> I mean, they killed zombies and they killed zombies and okay. they killed zombies and they killed zombies and they thought they were going to escape and get to a place, a safe place. Right. There's no safe place. Okay. There's no safe place because their safe place ended up getting eaten by, guess what? Zombies. So they hop in a boat. The zombies can't do anything in the water. They just drown. So they hop in a boat cool. and they take off and go. But they fight, okay. they fight, and they fight. Find an island somewhere and like hunker down. Okay. Yes. All right. Uh, Dr. Sleep. Yeah. It happened upon Dr. Sleep. Yes. It was the second part of The Shining. Yep. Loved it. Loved it. Um, it. Grown up, he goes back to the hotel. Very cool. He hooks up with a little girl. They have the shine. They have the shine together. They see the dead people. Really good. Yeah. Enjoyed that movie very much. Yeah. Um, then uh, Motherless Brooklyn. Um, happened, up, happened upon that. Matt and I enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. um, I got a little lost in the end. His boss was Bruce Willis. Right. And because of him, Bruce Willis ended up dying. Right. Um, yeah, but he was really smart. And he ended up uh, wrapping up the murder of Bruce Willis yeah. in the end. Is Ed, what I Ed got Norton out of it. was the star, and I think he also directed and wrote the dang thing, I maybe. Do. But he had Tourette's, that. so he was like a guy in the 1950s with Tourette's. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it was it it was pretty funny. Him cool. and that Tourette's was yeah. really funny because yeah. he would stay really inappropriate. Yes. Stuff, you guys. <laughs> That was funny. And it made everybody uncomfortable. He went to light that match for the girl and he kept blowing it out. <laughs> and finally she was like, just forget it. You're right. Just forget yeah. it. I keep a lighting the matches and he keeps blowing them out. <laughs> Okay. All right, and then uh, the the good liar. I enjoyed that by myself. Ooh, Unfortunately, okay. Matt wasn't here for that. It hey, had Helen Mirren right. in it. Oh yeah. And it had uh, the the uh, Harry Potter wizard, the Dumbledore guy. Oh oh. Okay. <laughs> Am I right, Dumbledore? Yeah, I know, I know exactly what you're talking about. Wait a minute, it'll come to me. So he preyed right. on older women. He would go on the dating site, and he preyed on older women. And him and his friend would get together, and they would get people to invest their money in in something. Con men. Yep. Con men. Mm -hmm. He would get their money to invest their money, and they would have this little machine, and they would punch in how much money they had, and the other person would punch in how much money they had, right. and then he would drain their bank accounts, completely yes. drain their bank accounts. But <laughs> Helen Mirren had a hidden agenda. Ooh. She wasn't a con man, but she had a hidden agenda. Hidden and agenda. Wait until you see what happens. Cool. I'm not going to spoil that for you. Cool. Uh, anything with Helen Mirren in it makes me very yeah, happy. Yeah. I love Helen Mirren. Yeah. 
So watch that. Watch that and see what the story and, is. And I'm just about. drawing a blank right now. It's the guy who played uh, Magneto and the guy who played Gandalf, right? Is that the same actor? Um, uh, Dumbledore. Dumbledore. The really old man. The okay. wizard. Right. Okay. With the long beard. Yeah. And he came up in the house with the um the the ones with the big feet. Yes, the, the hob the the, the, the Hobbit. Um, Lord, of the Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings, and the Hobbit. He yeah, always, that's him. That's him. Yeah. He always plays. The you old, shall the not pass. Wizard. Yeah, he was Magneto, and he was also um, um, you know, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, his name, the, uh, it's, like, it's like you have this mental block, and it will come to me, and I'll be going like, why didn't I say his name? He was knows blah, everybody's blah, blah, blah. name. He's amazing. Okay. The Good Liar. Right. Don't miss it. Um, a Fall from Grace. We yes. happened upon that. Tyler yep. Perry's movie. Mm -hmm. It was actually done in Virginia. Oh, really? When you watch it, wow. when they go to court, it's it's in Virginia. Cool. Um, it has Alicia Rashad in it. From, I thought it was Felicia. Felicia. Is Alicia. It, oh, is it? Felicia. Okay. okay. I, well, was she was on the Cosby show. She, Cosby yeah, show. If she was the woman who played Bill Cosby's wife, wife, Felicia Rashad. The one who made sense of everything okay. in the Cosby show. Okay, right. Um, it was really good. This woman is on trial for killing her husband with a baseball bat. And... And uh, I don't want to ruin it for okay. you because in the end, when you find out what happened, you're like... What the what? And her friend is Got a Alicia twist in the story. Rashad. Okay. okay. Her okay. friend is Alicia All Rashad. Right. And and when you find out what happens in the end, you're gonna love it. Um the little girl is trying to defend her, but she's known for um pleading things out okay and that's all they wanted was to plead the case out they didn't want to fight the battle right they just wanted to plead that's it what out. they do that mostly they do in real life is they don't really want to go to these fancy elaborate trials they want to make a plea bargain you know but so, yeah. she ends up piecing it together okay. and her boyfriend is a cop right. and he's very helpful and he helps her piece it together and then you find out what really happened in the end so you got to watch it to the bitter end okay Okay. And I'm not going to ruin it for you. You Duck. are going to have to watch this one. All right. And then uh, Playing with Fire. Oh, my God. That was so funny. It had John Cena. Oh. It had right. John Leguizamo. Right, 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 and it right. had Key from Key and Peele in it. Right. <laughs> and they are fire jumpers. And fire wow. jumpers are the ones who jump from the helicopters into the middle of a fire yep. and make stuff safe for everybody. And John Cena did a really nice talk about the stuff that the fire jumpers do before the movie started. It was really cool. cool. But they jump in and they save these three kids. It's a teenage girl and a, a middle middle aged little boy okay. and a little girl. Cool. And they bring them back to the fire station, and they're trying to contact the parents to come and get them. And the parents they don't hear anything from the parents, and come to find out, the parents had died. And the kids were alone, oh. and they were in that house because um, they had to be together. Right. And and the fire jumpers jumped. It was in like a party them. of five situation where they were pretending to have parents and they didn't have parents. And man, those kids make a mess of that firehouse and the of guys course. and everything. Of course. And of course, I don't have to worry about spoiling it for you in the end because of course, of course, John Cena. And his little girlfriend end up taking the kids in. Of course they're going to do Surprise. that. Surprise! Because it's one of those movies. It's a Hollywood happy ending. But it was funny, funny, funny. Good. They had so much well, fun good. with the kids. It was really, If it's entertaining, it's good. It was okay. really Even funny. if it's a formula, it's good entertainment. Especially the little girl. The one guy walks around with an axe all the time, and they call him Axe. And and he ends up just loving that little girl Aww. and her little unicorn. A future glitter. sociopath. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was okay. so cute. He loves that little All girl. Right. Cool. All right, and um, playing with fire, and there were a couple of uh, oh my gosh, there were a couple of uh, previews that I got to tell you. Okay. One was called the drone, uh, drone foot at the foot of the bed. It's from zombie beavers and critters. Zombie beavers. Yeah. The heck? Yeah. The zombie <laughs> gets out of control. And I wrote down drone foot of the bed. There must have been a funny scene that I saw right. in the preview from All that right. that I can't remember sure. at this point. Sure. But I remember the drone gets out of control and nobody's in control of it. Dang. And it's doing all this crazy stuff. 
I mean, okay. if it's from Zombie Beavers, clearly it's okay. going to be some wacko stuff. Sure. All right. There was another one called Rock, Paper, Scissors. Um, it had uh, uh, Tatum O'Neill, and it had the guy from 90210 in it. Luke from 90210 Luke in it. Luke, Luke Perry. Okay. Maybe the older. Possibly, is, which yeah. Which one passed away? One of them passed I, away. Did, wasn't it, it him? It was the older guy. Wasn't it him? Or I, I, it, it, he played the character Luke. Okay. Okay. And it, But Tatum O'Neill, guys. Tatum O'Neill. Hadn't seen Tatum no, O'Neill in a no. long time. Paper Moon. Rock, paper, Way scissors. Back. Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. And that one looked like it was going to be pretty good. Okay, cool. Um, it, and sheer lack of anything yes. in the red box Nothing today. Nothing in the red box today. Nothing this week, Barren, you guys. like like tumbleweeds like going down the street. Like two movies, and, and and they weren't even like rentable. She had to pull out the old DVDs to watch them. So I she watched, watched Pineapple Express again. I did. I, I, <laughs> I fell asleep because I had to take a nap. But I started watching it again. That was but a funny I, movie. I did watch Talking Dirty After Dark with Martin Lawrence. Okay. And I really enjoyed that. There you go. A bunch of shenanigans. Yes. From that era of time. Right. Um, he wanted to be a comedian, and he was sleeping with the boss's wife. And the boss was, the boss was the dad from Friday, which just passed away. Oh, recently. I know exactly who oh it is, but I can't God, remember his that name. Guy is yes, funny, yeah, he's funny, shit. funny, funny, funny. And it guy. also had the big bodybuilder guy, and and uh, with the kind of cross looking oh. eyes. Oh, I know his name. He had he, him he, in he, it. He was, he was called Zeus. In the WWE, but yeah. the, uh, he had yeah. like a name like Morris and, or something. And the whatever. chick that was the lady comedian, I know I've seen her, but I, I it's okay. been a long time since right. I've seen her. So but retro night, yeah. Talking mm -hmm. dirty after dark. Cool. Really enjoyed that. All right. I, everybody knows Pineapple yeah. Express. I don't okay. need to review that. All right. Well, I hate to cut you short, but we need to wrap this up because we might be running out of All memory right. time on the phone. So I'm gonna leave you guys with. Do what? Bop, bop, <laughs> do what? Ear ear Hanson. We okay. had a bottle of wine. I gotta throw this in. Oh my God! We had yep. a bottle of wine. A new one. Something new. We haven't had something new in a while. <laughs> wine alert! Wine alert! She bought it by mistake. She yeah. thought she was in the wrong section with the wrong price. Yeah. Menage a trois luscious Pinot Noir. I didn't care for it. I'm I hold it Matt up so drank it. I drank a sip of it. I didn't care for it. Please don't spend thirteen dollars on it. it if is you can not, find it cheap, though, I if, thought it was okay. If it you wasn't can find bad. it for the price that I found it for, it was it, not bad. I wouldn't buy it again. Uh, eh. I, I, <laughs> I, I did not spit it out of my mouth and curse the people who made it. So well. I'm glad I bought fifteen cases of rich and spicy. <laughs> We're, we're down to how many cases now? Three. Three. Oh. But we still have two cases of Mato. Okay. So we're oh. safe, Matt. Okay. We're safe. <laughs> Shoot. I was scared there for a second. But y'all watch some of these okay. movies. Um, Dead Earth, Doctor Sleep, oh. Motherless Brooklyn, The yep. Good Liar, A Fall from Grace, yes. mm -hmm. and Playing with Fire. Yep. Because I don't think you can go wrong on any of them. Right. Oh, and by the way... Happy Valentine's Day. Yay. And here's a picture of the donuts I bought for Joby. Valentine's donuts. <laughs> and I got my Matt and his mom a really nice basket. She did. It lights up. It does. It does. It's got to light up. It's awesome. Plenty of glitter, plenty of lights. There you go. There you go. <laughs> glitter, balloons, and lights. That's it. You, got, you, you, you win with us. There you go. All right. I hope y'all have a happy Valentine's Day. Uh, sit with your Valentine and watch a movie. Yay. God, get him a card. A card means so much. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry we missed you guys the last couple of weeks. We promise we will not pass out in a blackout. We'll try. Yeah. That's why we filmed this video early, by yes. the way. Spoiler we alert. We filmed this one early we as did. opposed to look later. Look how sober we are. <laughs> yeah, I know. We don't look like look, we've been drinking I could, I, could, I could walk a straight line if I had to. <laughs> All right. Good night. We love you. Y'all have a good one. Happy Bye. Valentine's Day. <laughs> Bye. Thank you for watching Joby, a movie and a bottle of wine. <laughs> yeah, I left the dollar store today and I couldn't believe I didn't get a balloon. Oh I always goodness. get balloons when I leave the dollar store, man. <laughs> oh.